evening you guys welcome to tonight's video so i am going to be showing you guys my nighttime self-care routine i don't do these things every single night because it's hard to keep up your self-care routine every single day obviously because sometimes you just don't have time for it and it's unrealistic but i'm going to show you guys a night in my life that i do pamper myself like nights that i do like to pamper myself yeah we're gonna do it together i've been honestly not feeling my best lately because my eczema has been flaring up i got an iud and it's giving me a lot of like hormone imbalances which is making it flare and i just honestly have not been feeling my best so i think i deserve a self-care night and it's also nice to do this once in a while because i haven't done one in a while so yeah I hope you guys enjoy this video. It is currently 6 o'clock actually. I just ate dinner, finished up my work. I just had leftover soup for dinner or something special. Yay! I hope you guys enjoy and it makes you calm and relaxed and we can have a cute evening together. Okay guys, so the first thing that we're going to do is we are going to change... I mean not change, we're going to wash our bed sheets. I haven't washed our bed sheets in a couple of weeks and they're supposed to be done every single week. Because if you think about it, you are literally on your bed eight hours a night at least you're sweating you're rolling around you're rubbing on the sheets and it's kind of disgusting if you don't wash them frequently you know and when i was younger i used to be able to go like a month without watching washing them and then i realized like i saw this thing that said you should be washing them every week and i was like shit that actually makes a lot of sense so anyways we're going to wash our sheets because i haven't done it in a while and so this is your sign to do it too but also, one of the best feelings literally ever is getting to crawl into bed, clean, like you've done your self-care routine, into brand new, freshly washed sheets. I think that's just one of the best feelings in the world. It's just so good. So that's what we're doing tonight. We're setting ourselves up for success, baby. Okay, let's go. package in the mail and i wanted to unbox it with you guys because there's some like self-care products in here that i want to obviously show you and i have some repurchases in here too of products that i've already like tried and stuff and then i ordered again that are a staple part of my routine this is um from the sephora sale by the way let me know if you guys ordered from it i just got like a few things i didn't go too crazy i spent like 80 dollars but could have gone crazier for sure and i was gonna make another makeup order afterwards but i didn't realize that the sale ended and then i went on their website to go do it and then i'm like oh shit i missed it but whatever cute okay first of all here are the samples that they gave gave me these aren't even the ones that i picked out because you know how you can pick them out on their website i literally already have the shampoo because show that's funny so the first thing that i got that's actually a repurchase i just actually ran out of this this morning when i was using it in the shower but this is the oat cleansing balm by the inky list and i love it so much i have been like i said flaring with my eczema i usually use this cerave hydrating um cleanser this one's really popular i used to use this every single night and it was completely fine for my skin i loved it i've been using it for years now but ever since i started flaring with my eczema my skin has been irritated by this which is crazy so i'm just like holding off until my skin gets better um, from using this but i was looking for a cleansing balm anyways and i came across this one because it's supposed to be good for eczema and dry skin because of the oat in it apparently oat colloidal oatmeal oatmeal can really help with eczema so i was like holy shit this is perfect because it's a cleansing balm um a cleanser and it's made for sensitive skin so i actually really love this it actually soothes my skin 10 out of 10 would suggest this especially if you guys have dry skin and it's only 13 dollars canadian it's so cheap i don't even think this was discounted from the sale because um i think this brand was excluded but it doesn't even matter because it was so cheap and i love how it's like a two-in-one because it takes your makeup off and it cleanses anyways um second repurchase is this hyaluronic acid from the ordinary i use this morning and night just a little bottle i actually have like half of mine already left but i didn't want to run out so i just got a backup but love this so much so cheap as well only seven dollars and it just 
really helps lock in the hydration in your face it helps it's good for dry skin and oily skin definitely would suggest if you guys are looking to add something into your routine okay so these are two new products that i wanted to try so this is the ordinary multi-peptide serum for hair density so this is basically a hair scalp serum that you're supposed to like dot in your hair just to help with hair growth and everything so i thought that i'd try this out because i've heard really amazing things about it and like before and afters apparently it makes your scalp a little greasy i don't know if that's true so we're gonna have to try it out i did just wash my hair okay last product that i bought is this sos tower 28 daily rescue facial spray and the reason why i got this is because i heard about it on a podcast and apparently if you have sensitive um skin eczema like apparently this is just a holy grail spray and i was looking at the reviews for this on the sephora website and i saw girls with eczema like all the way down their neck and then they use this spray and it's like a miracle worker like their eczema literally heals so fast and i'm like what in the world i have to try this out especially because i have been flaring recently the girl said that when she was going through pregnancy her eczema was flaring on her face and she started using this and it was like a lifesaver so i am so excited to try this i've been waiting for this to come in and then this is just a thing that i got with my points this is my favorite cream ever it's the first aid beauty ultra repair cream i have a big tub of this and i just wanted to get a mini version with my points because i was like i use this daily so this would be nice to just have on the go but i use this on my face i use this everywhere honestly it's the best thing yeah would suggest but definitely get it in a bigger tub because this will not be enough but yeah so that is my little sephora haul I'm so excited to try these two out. So I just made um, this tea called the Everyday Detox Tea. I actually haven't had this one in a while, but I, because I forgot how much I love it. I love having some sort of hot nighttime drink because it kind of just like sets me in the vibe and it just like relaxes me. Yeah, so I think I'm just going to relax now, watch a show. And then after I'm finished my tea, then I'm going to run a bath and then we can really start our self-care with the face mask and then skincare routine and everything. So cheers. I just put a little bit of honey in this too. Let's go watch a show and drink some tea. I've been watching... Gilmore Girls right now. I've also been watching The Kardashians. I've also been watching Dancing with the Stars because those episodes come on weekly. Oh, Love is Blind too. Me and Joel are watching this together. We're only on episode, I think we're like in the middle, maybe near end of the season now, but apparently it's been getting really juicy and we're not caught up. So maybe we'll even watch an episode of that right now. But I think that is it. Comment down below any recommendations, but I'm honestly excited to get the Christmas movies going we already have a christmas tree set up as you can see behind me it's not decorated yet or anything but we just wanted to put it up so that vlog will be in december but we're so excited to do it because it's our first christmas together in this apartment so we're excited but okay let's enjoy this tea cheers <laughs> Okay, so while we wait for the bath to run, I just decided to put on a face mask and I didn't put it like all the way. Like I left some skin here because I have been like flaring with eczema here. So I didn't want to risk it and put a face mask on it just in case. But anyways, I want to talk periods. You guys know I'm very open about that topic on my channel because I 
think I have. I was never formally diagnosed, but I think that I have endometriosis. And I have suffered for years now. Like I'm telling you years with the most painful periods. I would throw up with pain and it was the most horrible thing literally ever. I have tried prescription painkillers, um, obviously Advil, Tylenol, all that stuff and nothing helps literally nothing helps i would be in excruciating pain every single month it would affect my week because it would prohibit me from doing things and it was just horrible i always had to plan around it and i knew that the day that i got my period i was just bed bound couldn't even leave the house couldn't leave the bathroom like it was horrible having my periods actually held me back from doing so many things and it's just so annoying to me because i feel like a lot of doctors they don't take you seriously they don't know what your pain feels like even i've had some female doctors that have done that to me who didn't take my pain seriously and i literally was in the emergency room one time because i was in that much pain so anyways i would like to introduce today's sponsor which is Rhea. and you guys don't even know how excited i am to be working with them because period pain is something that is close to heart that i've dealt with and suffered from for years now and they are providing a solution to that problem and it's nothing artificial there's no painkillers involved that are horrible for you because putting that shit in your body is so bad for you you guys and especially when you're taking very high doses of it which i was and it still didn't even help so this is a sticky patch that ram made but basically what you do is you peel it off and you put it on your stomach on your lower abdomen and then you can turn it on up down like really alter it to the massage level that you want but what it does is it does like some shiat japanese shiatsu massage and basically it delivers exactly what your body needs to produce and get rid of your pain and what i love about this is it's not invasive it's drug free you don't need to put anything in your body so i personally i got an iud um a few months ago because i didn't know what else to do and i wish that i found this sooner because that was kind of just my last resort there was no i just felt like i couldn't do anything else at that point but anyways i've been getting i've been still getting my periods on my iud and they've been pretty painful and not as painful as they used to be but the last period i got i tried this within like 10 to 15 minutes my pain was at like a level eight and then it reduced it to like a level one like i can still i still felt a little pain and then it slowly tapered off it also has like a really good um battery life so i literally kept it on for so long and i just went about my day because it can hide so well underneath your clothing too this is like a brand that i really want to continue to work with because they are trying to provide you with like non-invasive non-toxic um solution for your period pain because i just feel like there's nothing real out there that works until they sent me this and i was a little skeptical if i'm not gonna lie at first because i'm like okay how does that how is that going to take away your pain but it really does work it really does just give it a few minutes and holy shit i have tried everything too i've tried those yoga poses that you're supposed to do i like i've done everything and this is the only only thing that actually helps me as women we deserve to take our power back and that's why i really believe in them because that's exactly what they're trying to do yeah i'm so excited to be sharing this with you guys and if you want to shop them i will obviously have their links down below yeah if you have any questions about the device too you can reach out to me or they have a bunch of information on their website but this has truly been the only thing that i've seen results with you guys please if you guys suffer from bad period pains if you have endometriosis inflammation get this do not wait another second but yeah anyways thank you so much to Rhea for sponsoring this video i am just so blessed the universe put us in alignment and i'm so happy that i can be promoting this to you guys but right, let's get in the bath baby <laughs> in the bath this is just so aesthetically pleasing right now i set up my starlight projector and my sunset light and it's a vibe it is such a vibe i don't take baths as frequently as i used to but i always forget how nice they feel because just like going in the nice warm water just feels so good and it's so therapeutic even just doing a little meditation in here it's so calming and peaceful and relaxing and it's a necessity for a self-care night but anyways i'm just going to scroll on pinterest right now if you guys don't follow me on there go follow me because i recently just like organized all my boards and i've been pinning a lot of stuff lately 
I've been active on there so go follow me because I live on Pinterest like I have been spending so much time on there because it just gives me like so much inspiration for everything like my videos um pictures like just like everything so go follow me on there if you guys aren't already because Pinterest is just such a vibe and I love scrolling on there so that's what we're gonna do right now Okay, so time for my skincare routine. So tonight I'm trying out the Tower 28 spray and just putting it on like a toner. Then I'm going with the Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid. I like getting my face a little bit wet before using this because it's supposed to lock in the moisture. Then I'm going with the Ordinary Eyelash Serum. This stuff is seriously the best. Then here's me just brushing my teeth as everybody should. Then I'm going in with the first Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream and the Isle of Paradise Tanning Drops. I love these two mixed together so much. It just gives my skin a really nice radiant glow. And then I'm just going in with some Aquaphor to slug just because my skin has been extra dry lately. Okay, I just wanted to quickly show you guys this. So I just recently bought this on Amazon and it's actually a humidifier. And apparently it's really good for eczema, dry skin, especially in the winter time when there's barely any humidity. Since I'm flaring with eczema, I was like researching what helps and apparently getting a humidifier is game changing because it puts a lot of moisture into your skin, etc. And apparently it's good for a lot of other things too. So this is only like the third day that we have it running, so I'm not sure if I've seen a difference with my skin yet, but I'm so excited to have this, and I'll link it down below for you guys if you're interested. Yeah, apparently this is something that can help with dry skin in the winter in case you guys suffer as well. Okay guys, so I'm just applying some Aquaphor on my lips because I cannot live without it. I literally have like eczema around my lips and it's flaring and it's really annoying so i'm non-stop applying vaseline aquaphor whatever it is around my lips because i just need it this is a little one that i use so before bed i like to do really anything that keeps me off of my phone because i know it's not the best for you to be on your phone before you go to bed and then right after you wake up i mastered the not going on my phone before waking up but i've been trying to master the not going on your phone before going to bed because i do love doing some scrolling in bed so i'm trying to not do that anymore one thing that's been really helping is i've been reading ask and it is given i've been reading this book for so long now because i am now rereading it because it's a manifestation like self-help book it's all about all that kind of stuff so it's good to kind of just like always be reading it honestly because it really motivates me and it reminds me how powerful we are and it just like puts me to sleep in a really good way in a really nice way and keeps me on my phone i don't always go for a self-help book before bed i sometimes if i'm reading like a fiction novel i really like colleen hoover um right now i don't really have a new fiction book to read but i just like doing reading before bed because it really does like make me tired and it calms me down instead of like so much stimulation on my phone but yeah so i'm just gonna read a few pages of this ask and it is given book then it's going to be time for bed <music> wanted to share a line from the book that I'm reading. Within only a few seconds of focusing your attention on a subject, you activate the vibration of that subject within you and immediately the law of attraction begins to respond to that activation. The longer you keep your attention focused on something, the easier it becomes for you to continue to focus upon it because you are tr attracting through the law of attraction other thoughts or vibrations that are the essence of the thought you began with. The lesson that I'm learning from this is that it's very important to realize what I'm focusing my attention on and what like that all plays into what I'm manifesting and what I'm attracting into my life. So yeah, that's why I just love this book so much. It's just like such a good reminder because if you don't keep practicing, then you're going to kind of forget and it's going to phase out. But anyways, I am going to head to bed. I usually go to bed around 10 o'clock every single night because I do aim to wake up by 7. So I need and I love 
my long sleeps it's like necessary for me um so anyways thank you guys so much for watching love you guys